nice fluffy some cheesy eggs it's like a really easy way to have a bunch of spinach in a meal let's try these crispy potatoes mm. so good okay so this is breakfast and i'll catch you guys after my workout for lunch So I just finished a quick workout. I'm not really that hungry. Let's start making the ramen eggs. Look, look how easy the shell comes off because of the vinegar. Beautiful girl. Yesterday I made a shrimp parmesan type of lasagna for myself. I saved it for today, but I ate all of the protein. So I think I'm just going to make a couple more shrimps. I'm <laughs> a crack now because I cried so much. Yeah, yeah. It's cool. <laughs> uh, is this clean? Dirty? Nine forty-four at night and I'm just feeling a little bit snacky so I'm gonna make myself a yogurt bowl. Did I say granola? Yeah, granola. And maybe a little something sweet too. This looks like ice cream. So good. Today, I'm getting ready to start work from home a little early. So let me show you what's for breakfast this morning. Just warmed up a tamale in the microwave. I like to get these tamales from Trader Joe's. These are the Ooh. chili and cheese. With my tamale, I always like to just add a little bit of fresh avocado and Cholula sauce. Simple, easy breakfast. Because I'm a little extra hungry today, I'm also gonna make myself a little bit of a yogurt bowl. The same yogurt bowl as I made last night for dessert, but just a smaller portion because it's like an add-on to this breakfast. Seven dollars. Oh, why are they so fancy? These are smaller ones. Expensive, but not against our no buy rules. Okay, no, no. I love you, but no. What the? No, it's lips. Wait. I can't read anything. This you gotta put it. Parsley. You gotta put it in your nose. <laughs> if it's not parsley. Then you'll eat it and you'll like it. So we just got home from our appointment. I figure I'll put together like a quick lunch today. Let's start with some I am 
so excited to try this. I've never really made this combination of things before. It's just kind of what happens to be in my pantry right now. So these noodles, I forgot to show you guys, but these Thai wheat noodles from Trader Joe's. And then I made this sesame sauce, which basically just uses like a little bit of soy sauce, sesame oil, peanut butter, and Szechuan peppercorn. Look at this beautiful oyster mushroom. Oh man, I'm so happy. I should have made more. This egg just like gives me life. It is so perfect. Okay, I'm gonna keep chowing down. I will catch you guys at dinner time. We're gonna make a little pasta night together at home. So see you at dinner time. Okay, so it's dinner time. Turns out we don't have enough eggs, so we're gonna cut the recipe in half. Do you wanna help me make pasta? Yeah? This kitchen is not made for even two people, let alone three. We need one whole egg and three egg yolks. Separating the yolk is more difficult than cracking eggs. And we haven't taught you that. Wow, actually, I'm gonna take your yolk thing. Oh shoot, I just dropped the yolk. She left it behind, yeah. You did a great job mixing our mix. Okay, so now what we do is you make a little well, like a little Can circle. Oh, I escaped! Mix it, mix it. Morgan, help us! Mix it. hot sauce with regular eggs, but I feel like with an egg white omelet. I'm also not an egg white person. A little bit of ketchup as well. This is the morning. Breakfast is actually surprisingly good, and I really truly am surprised. That's how much I dislike egg whites. So good. I picked up the stinky little daughter from school. <laughs> and I'm eating sour pass and her tea sockets, and I'm gonna go to, what is it called? FAO Schwartz. Yeah, and build a bear, and the bear is head big. Okay, so why don't you finish your snack? Mila has made herself a little bento box of snacks before hitting the road, and I'm gonna make myself a snack as well. Cause I'm not really hungry, I had breakfast really late. Cooked up some noodles, and I'm gonna just drizzle it with a little bit of sesame oil, and then top it with a marinated egg. Snack time! some fresh guacamole. My favorite guacamole is a lot of cilantro and salting the onions and also smashing them. veggies so I'm going to get my asparagus soup that I made yesterday we're also having some sweet potato fries so that is gonna be what we eat today for dinner what do you want to start with first mm. do you like it she doesn't love guacamole but she does love chips no but it actually tastes good oh I'm glad you like it Gila is also having sweet potato fries and a little bambino pizza she also had a banana she's just trying to eat chips Oh, happy Friday, guys. <laughs> I didn't tell you what day it was. 
had a really frustrating morning this morning, a really upsetting few calls. So I decided to make myself some guacamole for breakfast because I haven't eaten and uh, I feel like guacamole, so F it. It's not a breakfast food. I don't care. Chopping some onions, I'm having some chips, and having a whole guacamole. I really want to go and get something to eat. I mean, I kind of love and hate how food can make you just, you know, can comfort you and make you feel better. I thought, you know, better to make something at home. Okay, so let me try to think about how grateful I am for this mortar and pestle and for food in my fridge. I am really grateful for having food in my fridge. It's like a cartoon, cartoon avocados. All right, look at all that fresh cilantro. All right, so I'm gonna have my breakfast and then I'll probably make a coffee and then I'll have to think about lunch, which is like now. And apparently a lot of water. All right, bye guys. All right, it is like four o'clock and Morgan has brought it to my attention that all we had today were snacks. <laughs> so it is time to make something like an actual meal, something nutritious. I'm gonna do just like a tofu veggie rice bowl. Got my block of tofu pat this dry. Yeah, it's done. And this is my lunch. Like I said, I make this bowl kind of a lot. The toppings are different based on what vegetables I have. Uh, today it's broccoli and mushrooms and carrots. The last little bits I had of kewpie mayo and a chili sesame oil. You're welcome. My camera's gonna die. Um, I guess I'll catch you guys at dinner, if there's a dinner. I'm not sure, today's a weird day. Good morning, happy Saturday. My friend was just over because she flew in straight from California and landed here this morning. Had a little snack. We did a morning yoga class together in the living room. Today, I actually am meeting a different friend who is in town. And so even though it's no buy and I'm not supposed to be spending anything, I'm finding it really difficult to figure a way out of spending. They also come down to visit us a lot. We're gonna go meet them out where they are and I feel like that's fair. I feel like this is a very balanced as in like a very up and down type of week. Uh, some days I'm really good at what I'm making and some days are just like a lazy day. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.